my book, Sangue Giusto in Italian and The Long Way to Rome in Dutch, uh, starts with an African young man who uh, knocks on the door of an Italian woman and basically tells her, uh, I am part of your family, we are relatives, your father is my grandfather. So this is a story about two main lines. One, the lines of Italians going to um, Africa as colonists in the 30s, and the other line is migrants now coming from the former colonies to Italy or to Europe. And uh, the main idea is to tell that these two lines, these two stories, are in fact two chapters of one story. Uh, the reason why I wrote this book is of course very difficult. This has been a long book to write, five years in the making, plus many more to think about, so the reasons are very complex. But I think it comes as, as all novels from a need, and the need is that to uh, find out more about um, the past of my country, the fascist past, the colonial past, and the way it intermingles now with the present, with uh, questions that I've had towards my father and towards the generation of my father. Uh, that generation, they were all basically fascists, they were educated as fascists, and then they were no longer were fascists. What happened? What happened after? What are the reflections of this on my generation and the generations that come later? And what I'm interested in, uh, as I tell novels, I don't write essays, is exploring the emotional aspect of the story, of this history, uh, communal history, but also in its very private aspects, in, in, in the way of uh, family relationship, uh, emotional relationships, and uh, so that the big story of politics and history really has uh, mirrors itself in the small story of human relationships. Mm -hmm.